smell good family smell good family before we get into today's video um gonna be talking about some niche products today so before we get started um if you're interested in uh, niche products and you're trying to level up your fragrance wardrobe and kind of step it up uh, a little bit in quality and experience head over to soul avant-garde all right soul avant-garde is a great uh, uh warehouse, warehouse i'm pretty sure they have one but a good website great website where they have a lot of different options of niche perfumery on um, there and a lot of things that probably could pique your interest but the dopest thing is they have sampling all right so you can sample before you commit to a full bottle um use my code dedrick20 all right to receive 20 percent off anything on so avant-garde all right so y'all check it out man uh the world of niche can be a little intimidating uh, but if you kind of take your time and especially use a sampling method then you can kind of discover what it is you like and what it is you don't like all right so y'all check out so avant-garde all right save some bread let's get to it YouTube, what's going on YouTube? What is going on? What is happening, man? Of course, it's your guy, one more time, Deidre Alex Jr. And I'm back with another fragrance video. Smell good family. Hopefully everyone is doing well, doing great, doing fantastic, positive energy and positive vibes. I truly hope everyone is experiencing that. All right, so today's video is another video that was built off of a record, not a request, but conversations that I drew from in my day-to-day -day life and bringing it here and creating the video and bringing the conversation to life, so to speak. So, um, you know, recently, you know, me and my wife just had our third child. So I'm recently just returning to work, coming off, you know, the bonding time and everything with the family and the new baby. So with that being said, the conversations of fragrances are have been waiting for me because I haven't been in my place of business for uh, a few weeks, all right? So the conversation now that I pretty much had all week long, this week was like, hey, I just need some, I need some just simple fragrances, some like upstart, easy going fragrances for multiple occasions. I was asked about everyday scents. I was asked about a uh, fragrance you can wear every day all year to the office, uh, like if I really want to dress up, but they don't, they, they're, it's a younger crowd and they don't want it over complicated. So you're not going to see any big time niche fragrance um, uh, recommendations here. These are fragrances that are great golden fragrances, legends in the game, and they will get the job done, in my opinion, forevermore. So we're gonna build a fragrance wardrobe today. We're not gonna complicate it. We're not gonna leave your head scratching. These are fragrances you can get out right now. Go to your local department store, smell these fragrances, and any one of these five fragrances can do anything that you want it to do. I think that's kind of simple, all right? So let's go ahead and jump into it and build a fragrance wardrobe without overcomplicating the process, all right? Up first, my first recommendation is from the House of Coach. Um, this fragrance is just an everyday staple. If you want it to be, it can do it all. We have the OG, we have Coach for Men. Coach for Men, all right. Man, I've had this fragrance for quite some time. As you can see, we are more than halfway done with this bottle. This is a beautiful fragrance in my opinion. And I guess because it's sentimental for me, while I say that, you get a nice fresh and uh, semi-fruity, uh, uh, kind of not fun, but uh, inviting style of a base fragrance here. And you know, we're not even gonna get into the notes. We're just gonna get into uh, uh, what the aroma provides, what the fragrance provides, all right? So this can be worn to the office and this is an everyday wear. Now with my recommendations for me, I'm wearing this every day. Wherever I'm going, no matter what I got going on, Coach for Men is an everyday wear. You don't have to think about it. It just smells really, really, really good. It could get you compliments. It could even possibly start a conversation. And this is something that, you know, you probably be proud of. You know, I'm proud to wear it. You know, how it makes me feel and how I go about my day, no matter where and how I'm wearing it. An everyday scent that you don't have to think about, in my opinion, a classic, out here, when it comes to fragrances, you got the original, the OG coach for men. 
coach for men. I cannot, this is highly recommended for me for sure. All right, let's continue to build your fragrance wardrobe, all right? Let's go to all my fellas who go to the office, man. All my office fellas who go in, and not particularly just a building where I think we all probably go to some type of building, but I'm not talking about, you know, lawyer's office or something pristine. Nah, I'm talking about my guys who may work anywhere, and this truly can work anywhere. So your day-to-day, -day, going to handle your business, going to your nine-to-five or whatever you got going on, this is just going to work and it'd just be good every day in my opinion from the house of dior all right we have dior own 2020 dior own 2020 it just is going to work guys clean fresh a touch of spice some musk in here is where there's a nice uh a little a buzz around this fragrance of masculinity if that makes any sense that's just what came to mind and 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 again any one of these fragrances we're talking about today can do it all but these are just the recommendations for me i wear this to the office every single day if you just wanted one fragrance to wear to work that's it you can wear this no matter if you work at best buy you work at a grocery store no matter if you're working uh, um uh, whatever <laughs> if you're working outside whatever you're doing you can put a couple of sprays on here on your body on your clothing and smell fresh and clean and this also has a DNA in it that is uh, something that will will probably have someone wondering what exactly it is that you have on. But most importantly, you're gonna like how you smell, whether it's this or anything else. And this is something that I love smelling to the office every single day, no misses for me from the house of Dior. I'm recommending Dior Own 2020 edition. This stuff is awesome, all right? Up next, oh man, my fellas, you going on a date, you're not trying to smell like, uh, you know, you, you just want to smell great. You want to smell pristine. You want to smell elite. You're not necessarily going for a profile, you know, of a gourmand or a, 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 a smoky uh, or a resinous style fragrance. Nah, you want to smell clean. You want to smell uh, elite and something with a DNA that's going to make you attractive on a date night. All right. Now, normally I would recommend other things, but I'm talking about to my guys out there who are trying to build a wardrobe and they don't want it complicated. You ain't gonna, you ain't gonna be complicated by this. From the house of Chanel, we have Blue de Chanel, the parfum. Now I could have went with the EDT or the EDP, but I decided to go with the parfum because of date night. And what are you trying to do if you're going out on a date, especially if you're really feeling the person? You want to impress them. You want to make a good first impression. You want to create. You want to create conversation. You want to get the ball rolling, especially if you're interested in that person. And this right here would definitely do that. So many good and great just staples in this scent from top to mid to the dry down. It just checks all the boxes. It has. Uh, it's clean. It's fresh. It's bright. Um, it's 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 it has body to it. It has a little bit of depth, a little mature level to it compared to the first two versions, the EDT and the EDP. This is just a the well-rounded version of the DNA. Um, and if you've ever smelled Blue de Chanel, you haven't got your nose on a parfum. I highly recommend it. Now I could be a little bit biased because this is my favorite fragrance of all time. Number one on my list. Take them all. Leave me the parfum. I'm good to go. This right here for a date night, she, in my experience, <laughs> she is going to be paying a little bit more attention because the presentation that you're putting forth and the way that you're smelling, she's gonna be locked in. I definitely recommend this for a date night right out the gate. You're not trying to overcomplicate things. You want a good, solid to great or elite style of fragrances, in my opinion, from the house of Chanel. We got Blue de Chanel, Parfum, Parfum. Like I said, we're not gonna get into notes. We ain't breaking down these fragrances. We're recommending these fragrances for, uh, you know, you guys out there who are trying to build a solid, a strong fragrance lineup for sure. And this one that we're talking about next, this is something that you can dress up. All my guys up there who wear suits, all my guys out there who are putting on the, um, 
uh, uh, what do you call it? You, you being fancy and double now, and, and 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 it really, really, really matters for you day to day. You know what you're wearing, but you want something to match that. A little masculine touch. I recommend this from the house of Polo. We have the not new, but the latest from this line, maybe the last Polo Blue Parfum. Polo Blue Parfum. Man, this is the best of the line, hands down, in my opinion. And why would I wear this on a very dressed up situation? You get a nice blend of citruses and spices, and woods, and a lot of, you get a masculine touch for sure. It's gonna be undeniable and unmistakable with this fragrances that you are about your business, you know what's going on, you're intrigued in successful results. And by the way that you're dressed, suit, tie, slacks, hard bottoms, the way your beard's trimmed and you know being taken care of or your hair all those things man it's undeniable and this is going to be sort of like icing on the cake with that type of vibe i definitely recommend this for my guys who are suited, zooted and booted on a day-to-day -day basis um and, and and you want a fragrance to kind of match your vibe that masculine touch from the house of polo i definitely recommend this polo blue parfum your stuff is good man this stuff is good for sure all right and last but not least all right someone who just wants something that is clean and something that is fresh and again you can just uh parlay wearing it you can wear it to the gym run errands to the uh, whatever basically another versatile versatile fragrance for everyday life for everyday life all right this would definitely work from the house of versace we have versace pour on Versace pour on clean and fresh, man. That's it. I'm talking about fresh out of the shower, clean, some touches of florals, um, a, a musk in here as well, a, a big bright fragrance, man, that could lift your energy and lift your mood. It's just one of those. It's just one of those for sure. Clean and fresh nothing to think about this is not going to rack your brain or rattle your mind and know what's going on with this particular fragrance it's not going to do that it's just going to get the job done from point a to point b for my fellas out there who are looking for something like this for sashi pour Homme is a classic in my opinion it is a can't miss fragrance in my opinion that's why i'm recommending something for someone who's just looking for something to grab and go grab and go no complications from the house of Versace. We got Versace pour home. Versace pour home. All right, man. So those are five fragrances to help build your fragrance wardrobe for my guys out there who are not trying to be, you know, uh, knowing what um, uh, uh, cedar wood is or sandalwood. They're not trying to hear about geranium. No, 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 no. <laughs> they don't want to know about none of those things. All right. They just want, hey, does this smell good? And can I do whatever I want with it? All five of these fragrances can do whatever it is that we talked about this video. Flip them around, switch them out, they can do it for sure, all right? So this was, again, based a video based off a conversation that I've been having since I've been back to work, and I decided to bring it to, uh, to you guys, the Smell Good family and the YouTube uh, universe and Fragcom, and kind of put a conversation out there through video for sure. So let me know down below in the comments, Smell Good family, what are some of your... Uh, wardrobe fragrances we're not making nothing complicated all right so your perfumes the marley's and your niche and your rosas we're not no nah, we're not doing that you know we're talking about stuff that can just be easy easy breezy that anybody can rock with and anybody can understand for sure all right so let me know down below in the comments all right so until next time man hopefully y'all enjoyed today's video uh, be cool, be safe, take care of yourselves, splack it up, splack it down, splack it that thing all around. And remember what you put out to this world is exactly what you are going to get back. I appreciate y'all. Big love for y'all. No doubt about it. Like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. And uh, we'll see you guys on the next fragrance video. All right, y'all. Be cool.